just flipping this piece around with my poking stick and i thought it was a piece of glass there's a lot of glass in this creek and a lot of a lot of the stuff in here is creek stained and i had to flip it three or four times to realize it wasn't a piece of glass Oh, wow. Looks like a pickwick with a base snapped off of it. It's an old break. Killer little piece. I'll go back to hunting and see if I can find anything else. All right, I'm walking a ditch. I don't really walk a whole lot. Well, we've had, had a lot of rain this year, so I figured I'd walk up it. And it looks like it has spit me one out, finally, after about probably 30 trips in here. That's that pretty red, pinkish jasper. Looks like a base might be snapped off. Oh, yeah. Base is snapped off a little bit. A lot of these pickwicks are found was the base is snapped off. They snapped off in the handles during use. I'll take them like that all day long. That's probably three inches. I'll get off here and see if I can find anything else. All right, I'm in one of my last resort ditches. And I thought this was a brick. And I flipped it over with my flipping stick. See the hole? It's a broke banner stone. I believe. Oh my gosh. What a freaking heartbreaker. Mm. Just goes to show you never know what's going to fly out of these banks and these ditches and wind up in the creek floor. That's why I love creek hunting. That's bittersweet right there. Mm. Alright, I'm going to see if I can find anything else. White Woodland Point. Well, I tell you, this slow, hard hunting in these last resort ditches is really paying off today for me. I got a creek stained point laying down in here. And I can't tell if y'all can see that or not. I got a glare going on here. Oh yeah, a little concave base point. I don't know what that would be. A little side damage. It's Jasper, it's just creek stained black. I'll take it.